don't sleep. We don't sleep. We don't sleep. We don't sleep. We don't sleep. This is we got the heat. We and you're watching Taco Talks, Talks TV. TV. You already know it, peoples. Hey, man. <coughs> what the fuck going on? It's your boy, Taco. Y'all yeah, see what I'm saying? Well, if you don't know, what's your name, bro? JG Riff. Okay, okay. Now, tell me. Tell me how you got that name. Like, what made you pick that? What's the What's the background behind the name? Uh, the JG Pop. I started for Jug Gang. Yeah, like, yeah. Me and Wap. Me and my people I hang with, that's what we with. And Riff. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, three years ago, motherfucker. My man, he, he, he be doing some tripping shit. He be fast talking and shit. Yeah. So he like, one day we just outside. He like, yeah, I'm smoking on that Rhythmatic. We smoking Rhythmatic. Okay. So like, after that Rhythmatic, we cut it the riff. Yeah. And I, I just ran with it, a little riff. My okay. whole motherfucker neighborhood name was Riff. Yeah, Dreadhead Riff. <laughs> Slick Riff, Pretty Riff, Dreadhead Riff. Damn. Shooter Riff. That's right. It sounds cool, like a little bit of lingo, like in the DMV, like we really be having lingo from all over yeah. the places and shit across the city. But shit, that's definitely <laughs> funny and shit, the whole hood name Riff. So how y'all know, like y'all outside, like Riff or? Nah, it changed, man. Everybody switched their shit. I just kept, man. Okay, okay. Respect. That's usually how shit start. I was telling somebody, like, everybody always want, like, a little cool nickname. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? To fuck with. But, um, what was I going to say? What was it like for you when you started rapping? Like, you just jumped into this shit, or? Pretty much, I could just say. I pretty much jumped into it. I always used to rap by myself on some quiet shit. Like, yeah. Yeah. Me and my man Con, we was out of school, I was in Carolina, we yeah. used to just motherfucking. What school you went to? Never stop. Okay. We used to motherfucking play instrumentals all night, smoke pride like a zip of weed. Yeah, and just go crazy. Just go crazy till like 6 in the morning. Yeah. And my mother then at 10 o'clock late night, we do that shit again. How was, the, how was them studio setups? Was they like the little home joints or y'all yeah. had like the lab at school? Nah, at first I had a little. Home studio. We had Cubano Smooth. We had a, a studio in the room. We used to hook that joint up. And yeah. Rap on that joint. That joint, what you think? You think, can you tell the quality difference? Yeah. Like compared from. Yeah, that shit wasn't bad, but it, it, it ain't better than this. Yeah, at least bad. Um, but how you get your name out there? Like, I seen you drop the tape or EP beginning of 2017. I'm like, what happened? Why we ain't hear more from you? Because I, really, I, wasn't, I wasn't really into no rap shit for me. Yeah. I, I did that shit just like on some fun shit. Like yeah. I said, with comedy, he jazzed me to do this whole shit. <laughs> Are you fucking with it? Well, yeah, I fuck with it. It's right. I'm getting used to it. I don't like all the attention and shit. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. So what's up with comedy? I seen y'all just dropped a song that joint was like that. Yeah, that's my dog. That's my right hand man. How y'all, how y'all meet? Was he from D.C. and North yeah, Carolina? <laughs> What? Oh yeah, put that in the interview. It says definitely from DC and North Carolina. <laughs> nah, but I knew Comments since I was like six. We used yeah. to, uh, he used to come in the same boys and girls club at number eleven and shit. So we was we been cool and tight since we was young niggas. Yeah. So we just grew up and we just kept in touch all these years. We just tight now. Mm -hmm. And so where you from? DMV, DC, Maryland, Virginia. No, you from Southeast DC. No, you. Oh, I'm from Southeast DC, straight out of the trash. Okay, respect. Um, what was I gonna say? But you got like such a large audience so quickly. You know what I'm saying? For you to drop that EP 2017, boom, come back to the end of 2017, beginning of 2018, like. It's hard for a lot of these niggas, everybody want to be a rapper right now. And it's hard for niggas to get an audience. How you get yours, like, so big, so quickly? No homo. The niggas, niggas not real, man. And, and a lot of people don't know these niggas. Yeah. Like, a nigga get on the track and say, he's so such and such, he done shot such and such. Yeah. Don't nobody, you ain't do that shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. People that watch me, they know what's going on out here. So they, they pretty much know. I'm really rapping what I'm saying. Yeah. I ain't just saying it to be saying it. I'm living this shit. I'm saying this shit every day. And that's what it is. I'm solid. Yeah. They know it. They know it like that. Yeah, respect. Um, what was it like for you when you when you did your first performance or all your performances? How you doing? It'd be cool. That should be job fucking me up. And I walk in and shit, and they, they be screaming and shit. Yeah. I don't know, crazy. 
and they get to sing my song, that shit, just, that shit hot water for real. You, you perform sober or smacked or what? Nah, I be sober. Okay. Why, why, why you choose sober? Some people be trying to turn up. You think you already turned or why choose sober? I just, I just be sober. Okay, respect, respect. <laughs> um, what do you got in, in store for summer 2018? Like, it's just now heating up, beginning of June right now. What you got, any big projects, big music videos? This shit about to get ugly. Yeah. <laughs> be gone. Yeah. It's my last summer travel. Okay, okay, respect. Is that gonna be the name for the table or what? It might, I don't know. But I got that weird sunny about to come out in July. Yeah. End of July, you can watch out for that job. And what's that looking like? Features, flow, what's it looking like? That job might just be straight me. Yeah. Okay, respect. And your flow is like that. Yeah, you your know flow that? is, I fuck with it, bro. Because somebody, uh, I think my man told me you had performed at a show. He's like, bro, you need to fuck with this nigga, bro. Yeah. So I'm looking. And uh, I think the first thing that popped up was over. Oh my, that shit was crank. What? How do you how do you get an original flow? You know what I'm saying? Because some niggas, you know, niggas hop on the track and be like, oh, he sound like such and such. Yeah, I was about to say, you can't get on no beat trying to sound like somebody. Yeah. You gotta, you, if, if this what you want to do and you say this what you want to do, you got to hear the beat and be like, hey, this how I'm going to come out of the job. This how I'm going to put my spin on it. I'm not getting on the job like I heard it. Such and such sound yeah. like this, so I'm going to do it like this now. If the beat feeling I could throw another nigga swag on there, yeah. I could do that too. Yeah. You gotta have flavor. You gotta yeah. be able to switch it up with them people. That's what they like. Cause somebody, I, I know somebody I was looking at the video for over. Somebody said you hop on the, the Don Vino <laughs> flow, but that joint was like that. Like it, I didn't feel like I didn't feel like you was biting. I didn't feel like nothing. I felt like damn, that was like perfect timing to hit the joint. I don't know which one came out first. Nah, but, his job, his job came out front, but there ain't no biting shit or yeah. like that. Nah, baby, I don't know, that's my man. Yeah. Ain't no new shit like that. And I yeah. told his ass, I said, watch how I do that. I sent it to him yeah. before I even dropped the job. Like, look, bro, I got that dog in for him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he know what's up. Nah, that shit like that, though, because I know, I know a couple people, like, you know, you can switch up the flow like that. Yeah, that's that's what I was saying. Saying. that's what I was saying. That's what I was saying. That shit was going so crazy. Um, Then you linked up with, you know, a couple of artists linked up with Romelli Twine. How, how did those songs come together? Like the backstory, was it like somebody hit you up like boom, hop on this, or y'all was in the studio or what? I said, like, I got a manager now, like I'm, I'm close with this nigga, I fuck with him. Yeah. So we had the same manager at the time, all three of us. So that's how that came about. We used to just sit in the apartment all day and make music. Yeah. I basically moved in so for like two weeks. Y'all got a whole bunch of shit that's not out? Yeah, we got a lot of shit out of But ain't none of that romantic shit getting dropped. Yeah. Why, why not? That's what I was going to ask you about. Why? And that guy ain't real. Yeah. Right I don't want to be hot. Nigga, you say I be hot, but I'm the interview man. I got to ask these fucking questions. Pussies. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all niggas don't know for Niggas don't know for real. You ain't got to talk too much on that. Just yeah. say he ain't keep it real. He yeah. know what he did. Respect. So, is it, is it some songs that just you and Twine? Cause I'm, I'm telling you, brother, Jay's crank. Yeah, man, Twin got a lot of shit. Yeah. Uh, Mike Burn. Mike Burn, I heard that nigga. Yeah, Mike Burn got a lot of shit. We probably got like 25 songs we ain't doing. Yeah. Drop. We so, do now. so what happened? Why, why, why keep like a vault of music? You know what I'm saying? I don't want to call it keep it. It just be niggas that be on their own time. Yeah. I be out doing it. When I got to do other music sometimes, we be having shit we got to do something. Yeah, respect. Sometimes our schedules don't meet up, so we can't do some of shit. Um, what about what about videos and shit? How does that go? Like, you like your video? What's your favorite part of rapping? My favorite part of rapping. Damn. That's deep. My favorite part of this shit is it's a little For real? So I won't get too much love out of it. be a like shit. Yeah. So so with the the genuine shit that do come that I do come across, I appreciate that shit. How do you uh, let's say for features, how do you decide that somebody is genuine? You know what I'm saying? Like, do you look at somebody and they send the budget first, or you look at somebody and be like, all right, I like what he's doing? It depends on who you are out here. I don't, if I don't know you and all that, yeah. and you coming at me wrong, like, I just supposed to respect you off the rip, but yeah. I don't know you. Like, nah, yeah. I respect everybody, but you ain't about to come at me all crazy, like, I supposed to, I owe you something. Yeah. So if you just come at me cool with respect, 
Yeah, I fuck with anybody. Yeah. Respect. Um, and what was I gonna say? Are all features paid for or some um cause niggas be wanting to know. Is is some features paid for or some niggas like bro I fuck with you, da 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 let's knock this joint out or that's what I wanted to know. Like I said, the pay who you are. Yeah. I got I got I got some good men that rap man. Yeah. And that pay me for shit. Yeah. yeah. And then some people like I need that shit, I need yeah. my money. So I eat. When you when you give stuff away for free, you ever feel like somebody using you or giving away too much? Hell, man, I got drip for days. Yeah, <laughs> too consistent sure. like a faucet. Uh-huh. Um, I was also going to say, uh, what other DMV artists are you are you fucking with that we can you know go by by name? Alright, uh, so you know I just said Mike Brown. Yeah. You know Twisty, his brother Cal. Yeah. 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 Motherfucker. Definitely Z Rock, though. Yeah. Z-Rock. I'm fucking with Z Rock, too. Jose. Savage. Yeah. You know, other than that, like, Karma, of course. Yeah. Walk yeah. my favorite. Y'all about to say, straight up. How many, how many, like, people in, in JG are rappers? Like, I know I seen Wap and I seen you, and I might have seen somebody else. They, they, both of them, they rap. <laughs> hey, come here. Yeah, I gotta hop in the camera right. real quick. Hey, Rock. Yeah. Come on, Rock. In the camera. That's about bad big one right there. Okay. From Crank. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Down. That joint definitely Crank with the Y3 bag. I see you. You know what I'm saying? You know, he was on some new shit today. Nah, you can just hop in this joint real quick so niggas know what's up. Niggas can, you know what I'm saying? See who you are and shit. I ain't really no rapper though. I'm, I support them though. I rap. <laughs> <laughs> Respect. I support uh, Rick from Wild. Okay, okay. And um, shit. What what is it like for you? Like you don't care for rapping or you don't fuck with your flow? Or I mean, nah, it's cool. I just I know they better me. I be on yeah. bad times, so okay. I'm, I'm gonna support them. Put my money behind. Yeah, okay, okay, I respect I that. I rap when I feel like it though, but they, they need to rap all the time. Yeah, respect, respect. I can fuck with that. And so this come back to a question for you, like, what's the difference between you and all these other DMV niggas that want to be rappers? Like, I know already, but I want to hear what you guys say. It's a, it's a, it's a couple things. A lot of niggas ain't been through rough, so I ain't yeah. really got too much to talk about. A lot of niggas be trying to be something they not. Yeah. So I ain't never, you never gonna hit me to get on the track. Like, I got 50 bricks in the basement. <laughs> never. Yeah. Cause I don't got 50 bricks. Yeah. I never seen 50 bricks. Yeah. I, I appreciate it. Like yeah. That. <laughs> I, I ain't never seen that shit, so I'm gonna rap about what I'm going through right now. So yeah. A lot of niggas rap about a life they not living. Yeah. If you just stay down and rap about what you're going through, a nigga appreciate your strength. Yeah, because they can relate to so it. They can relate to it. So if yeah. I'm telling niggas what they doing every day, how I'm trying to go about getting myself better and better, they yeah. hear that shit like, yeah, young nigga talking that shit. Yeah. You know? So that's, that, that's, that's the main reason right there. Just be yourself on the deep. Yeah. Like, yeah. What advice you got other than be yourself to these niggas who want to be rappers, but it may not be working out so fast or like, if niggas just want to be a rapper for whatever reason. Stay down. Yeah. Time coming. Especially in my area right now. And now I see what's going on. Uh, DC about to go up. Yeah. Uh, they'll be pretty. You see what just happened with Q the Fool. And, yeah. Uh, and Don Bingo and shit. Yeah. So like the eyes on the city definitely. Yeah. So, and then I'm, I'm in a position where I can just keep on putting my music out there. And if I fuck with a nigga. I can help him get some attention, yeah, right? Yeah. So that's that that's really what my main focus is yeah. right too. Like, I wanna get I'm gonna say this on camera, I wanna get everybody together in the city so yeah. we can help get each other the fuck out of shit. That's it, bruh. I've been saying that hey Anybody go back to any of my interviews, bro, I be saying this shit, like, I be telling niggas it ain't nothing to just, you know, I'm trying to fuck with you, you fuck with me, da 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 but Niggas be having a hard time with that. Niggas be having pride. Yeah. I know pride niggas be well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, somebody told me that. Somebody told me niggas be characters as rappers, and then when they get in front of the camera, they can't keep that character up. I'm telling But, um, do you write or do you freestyle? I can do both. Yeah. Which one you do more? Right. Yeah. yeah. I think, I, oh, go ahead. That should be good one. Right. I, feel, I feel like a lot of niggas uh, say shit like, uh, it's an early man, I'm gonna call him. It's just shit like, uh, 
Yeah, like in the morning. Oh, writing, lame as shit, writing takes too long. Yeah. What made you, you know, decide that, you know, writing works better for you rather than freestyling? Today, right? And you just sitting yeah. in the studio for three hours trying to get one fucking right. verse. That shit, yeah. oh shit, man. <laughs> fuck, fuck. I'm gonna get, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm about to say. Shit, I'm gonna go and do that guy, dude. Fuck you, dude. But, uh, yeah, that's what I'm about to say. I'm gonna get that guy, dude. Fuck you, dude. But, uh, I fuck with that. I fuck with that. I think when, when you rap that shit, yeah. Put Billy Nut on the camera, man. Billy Nut on the camera. Lay your old calls and shit. Say wild shit. Oh, my bad, That's man. the cool guy. Cool, you straight, you straight. Um, Alright, but look, if you could do a collab tape with any artist from either the DMV, like a whole tape, like you know how niggas doing Super Slimey, the Metro Bone. Mm -hmm. If you could do one with any artist, producer in the DMV, who would you pick? See, bands, like I said, that yeah. shit gonna drip, bro. Oh, my God. Yeah, y'all need to do that. And get on some shit, we just in the studio every day. That shit gonna be crazy. Yeah. So, so Z Rock and then my producer, Kid. Yeah. The kid, the producer. Yeah. That shit like that. What about on a national level? Like, celebrities across the whole US, who would you pick? Uh, Kevin Gates. Yeah. Uh, young Boy. Okay, okay. I'm gonna give you one more. My, my favorite rapper, JD Kiss. Okay. So you fuck with you fuck with like old music. <laughs> nah, I just fuck with Jaden Kiss. Okay. Jay. Respect. Um, what about engineers? You know any engineers on the national level you fucking with? Uh, that beats just crank. Like who who got a beat that you feel like damn? I wish I had this so I could go crazy on. Zay. Yeah. Zay. Yeah. Zay Joe. Fuck that show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Respect. Up. Respect. Straight up. What's your uh your favorite strand of gas? OG. Okay, and what about oh. you? <laughs> oh, pull a pack out. <laughs> we really be swimming this shit. Yeah. I love it. Oh, I'm gonna let you show you got a good camera. Alright. Yeah, bug the bag. Mm. You got a good camera, dude. <laughs> um, this is real OG gas. I got back it up, so. Yeah. Real OG <laughs> Real pressure, bro. Yeah, respect. Definitely gotta keep some OG. Um, alright, so other than that, what's your favorite your favorite drug in general? Cause I heard you rap about a couple drugs. Shit, I can smoke weed. Okay. What's what's a drug you don't fuck with and you had and it was a bad experience? Boo. Damn. You be woke all day, bro. You do some crazy shit. <laughs> what was that what was that like for you? Like your first time booing up? You know what I'm saying? What was what was the occasion? Why would you? What what led you to that? It was hot in the summertime, and there was so much boot in the trap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Joe, bro, they really left like a gram of boot bro, <laughs> on the counter, bro. I was the last one to take the shit, so I took the shit the whole ground. We booted, bro. We I ain't gonna say who we was with. Yeah. Somebody tell you how. Me and my two brothers, we did some crazy shit. We all booted. I'm like, man, we gonna get these shoes. Yeah. So we about to go get the shoes, right? So instead of going to get the shoes, we took the whole shoe line down. Everybody <laughs> get it down. I'm on the boot trip. I ain't gonna sleep for five days. Damn. Five days. <laughs> five days. Five days. Five days. So was you angry like after the? <laughs> was you was you angry like after the third day? Oh, respect, respect, shit. Hey, look, you better hop into these random questions, the ones that I go crazy in the comments about oh, why the fuck would he ask that? Cause this shit funny. Pussy, <laughs> niggas be pussy ass niggas going crazy talking about something. Why the fuck would you ask this dumb shit? Cause it's a fucking random question. Pussy. All right, so look. If a woman offered to have sex with you and she would pay you, would you accept it? Yeah, pay me for the day. Yeah. It's like, respect, yeah. respect. So I make bitches go give me something to eat for dick anyway. <laughs> um, do you think that the lottery is a waste of money? Like going to play the lottery, you think that's a waste of money? Not if you hit that motherfucker. But the chances are so slim. Shit, my mom be here for little 500s and shit. We're gonna oh, yeah. Sometime. Oh, okay, okay. For the trenches. Respect. 
Uh, you fucking with honey buns or oatmeal cream pies? Honey buns. Okay, the little Debbie joints or <laughs> some other. Little Debbie joints. Oh, okay. Or jail in high school, I used to go buy a big ass box. Anybody that know me that went to collegiate or jail, I used to walk in collegiate with ten honey buns. <laughs> Wait, you? <laughs> Damn, you want about to sell them joints? What if somebody, what if I came up to you? Hey, let me get that. I need two now. Okay, respect. Respect for one, though. Was they the jump out? It's a 50 cent Hey, you selling them for $2. I'm going to eat all my honey buns. <laughs> you busting. Yeah, Busting heads for the honey buns. Definitely. Um, all right, you only can listen to one artist for a week other than yourself. Who you picking? Young boy. Young boy, respect. What's your favorite young boy song? Rock and roll. Rock and roll. I don't think <laughs> I. Nah, you gotta listen to that joint. I gotta go listen to that yeah, shit. Play that joint. This part of the interview. All right, got you. I'm gonna feel that fire burn inside me. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Throw that motherfucker in there shit, real quick. Man. All right, the last random question. Would you smack the shit out of the last person you texted for a thousand dollars? They passed my phone. <laughs> I think it's him. That shit gonna be crazy. It's gonna be him. Hold on. Oh, it might be him because I sent him a song. <laughs> Not a single. If it's him, definitely. He's gonna get smacked for free, so that's oh, nah. I'll go get smacked. Nah, yeah, on Jill, I. Yeah, he can't smack. I smack shit out of him. <laughs> hey, look, look, look. I told like, my brother in the car. Wild nigga, I smack shit out of him. He wants some gas. I told my brother in the car. I'm writing this joint down. I said, damn, at this moment, I'm the last person you texted, but I'm not going like that. <laughs> I'm not going we like that. Bro. Nah, we can't split that shit either. <laughs> I'm not fucking with it. Hey, look, man, cool little yeah, We got that dance for that shit in the air. Yeah, these niggas scream like a pig. We got them lips like a motherfucker chick. Yeah, spinning your block like a fit. I'm on your head like a motherfucker head. Yeah, we in the trap like a lip. These niggas hate, but they can't make a bill. He told that shit to get hit up Tell out the pound niggas go put that zip up Sit on my ass, then I got lit up I'm off your ass, this is a stick up I'm on the cool with my bird, it's a chill Don't jump off the thing, it's about to get justice Ain't got nothing to do, but he get it in seven Ain't fuck with each other, you know you be tough Ain't got nothing to prove that I'm moving with a mouth Got so much to do, so I'm moving with a bath I'm going to cool with my boy in November This shit I've been doing for the kids I'm getting up with no award to the kids You know niggas, I bought me a 40 for every year's nigga Motherfucking JG, anything you want to say, bro, we throw that in there for your time. Man, just be on the lookout for my new mixtape about to come out. A lot of videos, a lot of JG Riff. Yeah. A lot of JG Riff, a lot of Jill Gang, a lot yeah. of JG Rock, a lot of all that shit. Respect, yeah. respect. Hey, uh, make sure y'all niggas like and subscribe and do that shit, bro. Y'all know what the fuck going on. JG's voice of the, Voice of the youth out here, Young Taco. Let me do this shit.